Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. This is Jersey and today we are going to be working on the bridges. So basically what we're going to be working is the structure. I have a lot of bridges, especially coming out from my town hall and they're going to be spreading out to the island, right? We got going from north to south to east to west and they're all different levels. And when I face when I first placed them, I placed them and I, I thought I had like a, the base idea for the island, right? But as we are working it and improving it, they don't look as good. The entrances don't look as, as good. Sometimes the pathing of, of to go, going towards the bridges and where the bridge connect, it's, it's not the most, uh, let's say, pre prettiest thing that I have designed. And this is a video that has, is a long time coming. We've been mentioning it in the past and it's here. So we are, this is going to be a long one and we are going to work as much as we can. And we are going to, you know, hit it hard, hit it good and make all these bridges look really good. Because after I started looking uh, in Google and checking all the bridges that I was looking at, you know, they're at first, the way I was making them, they look more like ramps, you know, just, oh, here we go, and that's it. And a lot of the bridges that I, I was looking at, like, they they kind of bend, they kind of go, you know, up, sideways, and then down again, and, you know, they, they have a little more structure to it, and that's what I want. I want, in some of these areas, for the bridge to feel more elaborate than it just going up, and that's it. And this is what we're doing right here. So what we have here is a normal, you know, stairs just going up, takes you to the bridge and then you go across. So I want to duplicate exactly what I have on my other side because that one uh, came out really good. Uh, I was trying something new and I left it as that and I never did it again. And I want the entrance since I have now the double bridge uh, entrance towards the town hall the, um, I'm very glad that a lot of you have liked it. Uh, we are, so now I want this to be equal to the other side. And that's what we're working on. So slowly I've been, you know, going back and forth, checking one side out, uh, trying to get the measurements. But I noticed that this bridge won't be able to reach all the way across the way I have it right now. And so I started thinking, okay, what can I do because I don't want to start it where it's at and not have the same amount of space from the double bridge. So I started thinking and the next thing that I thought of is, okay, I, you know, when, when you see the rivers and you're going over highways and all that, so sometimes the bridge doesn't go across all of it and you got cement pillars, right? And then one bridge gets to there, the other bridge gets to there and then the pillars are just, you know, dividing the, the river. And that hit me and I was like, you know what? I think we can make that happen here. I think if, if I can measure out the distance that we have between this and the, uh, from one end of the river to the other, to where I want to start it and, and make it right in the middle. And then it just is also, it's going to give us something more to look at as, as we are uh, looking at the islands as we're walking around it I think it's gonna give us something extra so and that was the new plan so the plan was okay let me level this out that as you guys are seeing right now because now I, I will need to count from where the cement column starts and see how long it is and and of course I can just swim and use um, the machine it just doesn't work that way so I was like, okay, so I'm gonna have to make just a pathway uh, with the dirt printer to, so I can kind of count and then kind of take him out and then get to the middle and then use the dirt printer and then jump off and do what I need to do so I can get the bridge. And so I think we are about to start uh, very soon because right here, here's when I was like okay uh, I was trying to see if I could tell where would the middle be at just by looking at the bridge and kind of glancing it from the top but it, it was not so here is when I'm, I'm counting so here comes the dirt printer just one little row so we can just kind of count 
and I believe it was 14. So we're going seven on one direction and then I pick one on the other side. So I picked the one more to, towards that side, like it was more towards the river. So that should be the middle. And of course for the bridge, we need, um, so it'd be uh, two wide, so four, four in total. Cool. So we are making a square and I wanted to get rid of, of course, uh, the extra dirt that I, I put in there. So here, here we are and we're jumping, we're just taking that out and then the rest will be done with the dirt printer. And now we have uh, this little uh, column right here or pillar and and I think it, it did give something to to the look of the island instead of just being a long bridge because one of the reasons that I've been working on the bridges and they're not low, they're high. Also for aesthetic, I, I, I want it to look different and and more, a, a little more unique uh, in, in a way. But he, here we are, we are, we put both and you see the, the pillar and now we're just gonna finish putting all the brick around the, the, en the entrance of the bridge. Uh, on this one, there's just uh, one. And, and we are gonna be working on some of the other ones. So you're gonna see some of the other areas. We made them too wide. This one's up here on the front. Are still gonna stay. Um, they, they start, they come down with two, but at the end they're finished with one. Also because of space, because if I really wanted to make a two, I would really have to work so much more. Like uh, I have to like either destroy a lot of my entrance and I'm to a point right now that I'm getting very pleased with the way the town hall area is looking. It's looking more, more finished completely. And with all the Christmas decorations, it's just, it's, it's really, really top notch. So, so yeah, so right here, I, I noticed that I wanted to duplicate the same, um, the same what I have on the, on the other side. And I noticed that the tree was off because before, of course, I didn't have none of this and everything was long and everything was uh, a little bit more different, right? But now the sequence, since I've been moving thing, is now falling into place. So now we, we planted the tree where it needs to go. I added the other two uh, flower brick boxes and now that is even with the other side. So when we come in and we're gonna be looking at it, everything is set. So yeah, so, um, so right now, uh, I think I need a couple more of the Christmas uh, items that I've been uh, slowly stocking that I still need to try and to do more. Uh, the Sherry Farm is, is going good. Uh, I'm waiting for the next batch of cherries so then I can start getting more of the items, more of the Christmas items that I need uh, to, to storage. But I did wanna finish decorating the same way that I have of Christmas on the other side. So that's why I'm, we're using more Christmas decorations again. Uh, and yeah. Okay, so here, uh, of course, I, I moved the, the Christmas tree. And then on this bench over here, we're, we're gonna end it up moving because I kinda wanted to do the same thing over here, but I figured, oh, I can put a bench on the opposite way. Put it against the, the bridge right there. And you put your flower pot, you put the, the the flower that we end up putting. So I was like, I did like how that look and and just, I don't, I don't know, it just made it feel better. So I duplicated it again on the other side. So here uh, I'm, I'm going after a couple of red flowers because I don't have anything on me. And I remember where I, where I got this little island over here. Um, there were some laying around. So I went ahead and got them. We're gonna go and put them up where they belong. And I think we're getting closer to the kind of the first day of working on the bridge. We're gonna jump pretty soon to the next day. Uh, I was trying to pick up the 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 hunt uh, the beehive, but you know there, there's a friendly uh, alligator there that kind of wants to you know I guess he's a little hungry, saw us, and I was like you know what I'll pick it up later. Cause there there used to be trees there, and I went ahead and caught them. I'm being kind of off camera, you know, every time I'm at work or lunch and uh, I, I use the Steam Deck in, uh, in different areas. What I like to do when I play on the Steam Deck is kind of clean up areas that I need to do real real minimal work or usually most of the time when I play on the Steam Deck is gonna be for uh, 
item gathering and grinding things that I need, materials that I need. But sometimes I do do clean up uh, little things and I've been cutting trees that have kind of come up by themselves and they're just not where they're supposed to, to be. Okay, so uh, we went ahead and moved to the next day. It was getting late. And this is another section, this section here. And this one is gonna, we're gonna see a lot of changes right here because this connection between the stairs, the bridge, and another bridge. And one bridge is lower, the other one's high, the, the high one is matching the one on the other side, but the one that's lower is matching the one on the opposite side. And, and it was a little, it just, when you, you know, when you go up the, the stairs, it just doesn't look right. The, the division, the, the way, if, if I knew in my mind, it's just, you know, you get that feeling, that feeling that is just not right. So uh, I was like, you know, okay, I don't know how to fix it. I don't know which route I need to go. And we're gonna see that we're going back and forth, back and forth, trying things out and moving around. But eventually it did come out good like like you feel it like everything is is equal in every direction the connection of the bridge is looking good so right here I was trying to look um, how everything looks from this angle uh, I want to make sure that you know that that structure wise and the division and and everything is looking uh, good uh, so I'm still measuring, I'm counting. Uh, it's, it's going really fast, but I'm counting the, the space, like the, the area that I gotta work with and what, what am I gonna sacrifice? What am I gonna take out? Um, because there's something that, you know, that is off. And, and here's one, one version that I started playing out. Okay, so I wanted when you go up the stairs, I wanted to feel like you're going, that you can just walk to the back of the other bridge and and then you got these little two uh, high walls. But it's just, again, like, like you saw, it just, it felt too crowded. It just, it's, it's, it was making the space, anything that I was doing, it was making it feel more crowded. So I was like, okay, well, let's take it out. Let's take it out all the way to the back. And that's, here is when it started to feel better. Because now instead of being crowded, I started open, opening things up. Um, I tried the Christmas tree, uh, it just didn't, didn't work out like I had it before. And here I'm looking like, okay, so I now this side of the bridge, it just doesn't look complete, right? It doesn't look the same as the other side, just structure-wise or design-wise, it's not, I'm not feeling it, right? So I was like, okay, so how, what can I do? So I was like, okay, I, let's see what I can do with the uh, brick uh, flower boxes, right? And maybe we can do some type of design with them and then eventually put flowers or bushes. I think right now I ended up just going with the bush seeds because I still have some on me. Um, at the end, that's what we'll see a lot of the bush seeds. But eventually I think I want to pick the right flowers, pick the right colors that I want to put in that area. And then so that area can stand out very well. But okay, so here we are again and I'm, I'm still okay. So I decided, okay, I'm going to take this fence off because that fence was there since the beginning. I was supposed to do something, uh, maybe a building back here. Right now I got just the little visiting side and my ideas have changed a lot. What was gonna go behind behind the town hall. So right now, you know, I was like, okay, I need the space. I need, I need that area. So I took the fence off and right here, I'm starting to work again on the bridge because it still doesn't feel right. So it's like, okay, what about if I go one step in instead of the stairs starting here that it feels so close to the other stairs what if i just push them back because i still have space when when the bridge is connecting i still got like one free row so i went and i started pushing everything closer to the bridge and that started to open it up even more and and slowly as i was starting to see the more openness that and that's when it started to feeling more right i'm like okay Okay, so I need to go more open. I need to go more. So here I did the same thing. I was like, okay. So I feel like the stairs are still coming up too fast, too, too close to what I want. I would like to have one more tile row. So I push all the stairs down one back. And then we, we just kinda, you know, you work on it, you start fixing them. And, and this is when 
it's fun. I, I do enjoy it. It's, 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 it's a lot of work. It may, it may take some time and, but I do like the challenge. And then the, the re, at the end, the reward is so good because you're like, okay, this area came out really good, but there was still something off, right? I, I still feel like the three stair Y because, uh, so I have the three stair Y because it makes sense, right? I, I get to the end of the row. The row is three, three tiles Y. So I kind of wanted the stair to be three tile Y, but it's not matching, right? It's, it's just once you go up, things are not feeling right. So I was like, okay, so how can I keep fixing this? Because it still doesn't feel right. So I was like, okay, so what if I try to duplicate, you know, uh, what? When you go up the stairs and you go right, you know, that little entrance, but let's build what's on the left, build, build it on the right. But that means that I'm gonna have to make the stairs two, two wide instead of three wide. And I was like, okay, well, let, let me go ahead and test that out. And by testing it out, it started to feel structure wise. And at first I was planning just to take the, the rest of the, the dirt out and just leave it, you know, the two stairs and then the two sides. But, you know, I, I, I started thinking, okay, but in the future, we're going to have more items, right? And, and that's, that's the hope, that's the goal. Uh, and we know James is working on it. So, you know what? I'm going to do a little pattern design. So it's like one high, one low, and then kind of leave that. So maybe we can put a statue there, or maybe we, I can put a flower pot, maybe put some lights. And instead of just taking it out, I went ahead and left it in. And uh, as, of, as of this moment, and uh, even and uh, looking at it right now, I like it. I, I like that it, it feels full, it feels good. It feels like we have a big structure there. And now the connection on this area is getting there. And, and, and when you go up, it feels good. When you come down, it feels good. When you go from the other side, and we'll see that uh, pretty soon. Um, either right now or in the future walk, how it's looking when we go in from different directions. And I think that's what I'm testing right now because I wanted to see if it feels right and if the connection is is correct. And that's what we, we're looking at. So right now I put all the, like I mentioned before, we did, went ahead and pulled all the green uh, bushes. And for now, I, I think I do one more color instead of just being green. Uh, maybe in the future we get different plants or for now, I want to try different variation of, of color. Maybe we go purple, we go red or a combination of, of both and which one or greenery, maybe another type of greenery. And and that's what um, I, I need to do. And that's most likely off camera. It'll hit me and we'll work on it and then I'll, I'll show you guys. So here's the next connection. This is another one at first i was thinking can i make the same connection that i did on the other side but no because over here uh it's a little bit more different the way the bridge is at and and they're and the way it's connecting and everything is not as close anymore so i was like okay so i know here we need to do something different at the same time i i like the pillars when it's connected to the bridge to kind of stand out of the wall and then i notice that that the connection of the bridge not from from this angle but from the other one you see how it's brick and cement just flat with each other so i noticed that i wanted to fix that and we'll we'll get to that in just a moment and i and i knew i wanted to to kind of make those pillars stand out and then have more water around it and it's just visually i, I kind of like it and here was the same thing i I had the pillars fleshed out and I don't know, it just didn't feel right. I, it's just, it's not the look that, that I'm looking for. I want more, you know, it's just more visually that way when we're looking at it, we're walking around or, you know, you guys are looking at the island and once we do another island tour eventually, I'm, I'm, I want more things that it stands out. And, and that's the whole um, idea. So here on the, this side, I was making it kind of equal to the other side, making it a, li a little, little higher uh, and putting the brick that, that we need. And here I noticed this little side of the entrance right here, uh, I, I just kind of needed to kind of duplicate what we have on the other side. So it, was, it wasn't too hard. I just wanted to make it a little more even as we're walking in. So we went ahead and make it a little higher fix this other side that 
I was still missing one, so we went ahead and fixed it. We moved it in, and now it's feeling it, right? You you kind of you kind of see it. We went ahead and put a bench here, and now it feels like we have a nice little uh, seating area. Uh, we went ahead and grabbed the, I believe, the light, uh, and we're gonna move it a little more closer to the bench, and and yeah, and then slowly this area, it felt so much better, like more more finish. Uh, more coordinating like like it was actually designed not just thrown in together like I had it before so here we're we're gonna fix now this side as well and 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 we're gonna push the cement uh, the concrete pillars we're gonna push them out and I, I can't remember how many I we went either one no two or three out so we're gonna be seeing that uh, very soon uh, because at the same time so right here right we um, in this section here, we have a lot of bridges that, that we're seeing. We got the tall one, we got the one on the bottom, we got another one, and we got another high one. And I wanted to everything to not be the same, but at the same time, when you look at it, like if there was a pattern, and it's really hard for me to explain that, but I wanted to have an element of design to it. Uh, and but at the same time they kind of almost fall center and this is something that we're going to be working on because we got to work on this one the one on the lower and then we work on the other one and it was it was a little i would say it was a little tricky it was maybe a little bit um, ambitious uh of my part because I, I was truly trying to create something and then at the end at the end i think we're, we're gonna see that everything is kind of falling together in in such a way that's gonna work out so here we also expanding on this one a little bit more and and also uh see right here i, th I think it's, it's looking good and then now we're gonna raise a couple of pillars uh at the very end so we can kind of hide the the connection of the bridge instead of the bridges being floating i can this right here what we do right here is kind of to make it feel like the pillar uh not the pillar but the bridge is kind of connected to the brick and that's what i'm trying to kind of look instead of just the bridge being just there and just sitting there I, I feel like once we do we bring the brick up it make it feel like like it's complete like the bridge is getting into the 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 bridge is connecting to to the brick wall and and it's for me i i think for me it does look good but that's it's a little touch and then when i look at it from far away like right there i feel like it's complete instead of just being right just, just hanging and right here so now i start looking from here from those angles high up and what do i want so now i am happy with the one at the top so we are going to be working the, now on this one and on this one on my mind for i've been thinking a lot like do I want it to be really low? But the, the thing is on the bridges here that go all around, I wanna make sure that if the jet skis, uh, any of the rowboats and anything that we do, we can always go under the bridge. So, and I tested that, uh, um, I did test it that long time ago and, and I knew I, I gotta keep it on this height. So uh, for that way, when we are in boats or anything like that, we can, we can always go look, go down on the bridge so i was thinking okay so how do i want this bridge to work i almost took it out at first i decided oh may maybe i don't need it you know i don't need this side maybe i can just use the one on the side in and out but i did i did still want the look of seeing all these bridges in this little section so i was like okay so let's try to make it work so let's make it smaller instead of bigger smaller but i wanted the bridge to be centered to to the one on the top so when you see it so the idea is that the stairs are aligning to the concrete pillars that you see on the back right and then the bridge will go in the in the one in the front and then it's a little smaller and then we have this little tiny bridge that you can go underneath it and and i was like man i hope this looks good i hope that it really works out because I wasn't really sure. Uh, uh, and and then the end over here, it's like, okay, wait a minute, now I'm high, but the town hall is low, but going towards the museum is a little higher. So it's, it's like you have these two different levels and it took me a moment to try to uh, kind of put it all together. 
uh, but I did I did manage. Uh, we went ahead and just it's now it's two stairs on one side, one stairs on the other. And right here we're gonna do the same thing that we've been doing. We're gonna uh, finish this right here. We're gonna make it look like it's all together. We're gonna put brick. So here we are closing this part over here. We're gonna knock down the ones on the back, the one where the stars are at. We're gonna knock them out one lower. So it looks good uh, and everything is even. Uh, also, uh, at slowly we're gonna be working and right here, it's gonna look like we got this little hallway. And I think the effect, I wasn't planning for that, but the effect made it feel really good. Like um, later on, I was noticing it like, okay, I like this. It's like a little, like a little hallway and it just it just gave it more more character let's put it that way and more design and more like like more it's not just too simple so right here how we see is everything is falling center everything is falling gray it's a gray view doesn't matter which bridge you go to you you kind of getting a nice view so so now it's like okay so now how am, how am i gonna come from coming out from the museum if I don't want to take the bridge, but I want to come down, down the museum. I know I want more water on the other side. So all those hedges are going to come off and we're going to add more water there. Because I, I, I kind of like if, if I'm going to put a bridge, I just wanted to have a little more water all around it. So it kind of makes a little more sense. And so, so we're going to take all of that out. And slowly I started working, you know, it's like, OK, well, let's see what we can build what kind of structures we can uh, add right here and and then but i was kind of getting a little less i don't know if i want to say the word stuck it's just i couldn't get the right idea that i wanted to work the way uh because the, the space was so small and i was like man it's just it's not working out because i i don't i, I need two stairs to come down but then on this side I, it's only one but it, then it feels the bridge come out of the bridge and everything is just like boom like this wall and very small and as you can see we're, we're still trying and i remember the feeling of like okay so slowly i was kind of getting a little bit of a floor now so okay so i was like okay i'm getting something here uh, we just gotta keep playing with it keep moving things around let's take all this out and I think I went ahead and made the, the water that I, I wanted to have in next to it. But then I was getting to that point that I was like, OK, we are definitely going to need um, I'm going to need a, a moment to think about this a little longer. So I went ahead and it's like I'm going to call it a day right here and because I've been working for a while. And so and I was like, you know what, we can make a part two of this and because I still got the one behind it to work. So. So guys, if you made it right now, thank you so much for watching and don't forget to hit a like, subscribe if you want to see more videos and we'll see you next time on part two of the bridge builds. All right, guys, see you later. Bye.